Here's your latest flash briefing from Western Mass News. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. Cases of COVID-19 expected to climb exponentially within these next two weeks. We can expect to see a peak here in the Bay State between April 10th and April 20th. Here's a look at where we stand as of Thursday. The state reporting 8,966 confirmed cases. That's up 1,228 from Wednesday. There are 32 new deaths, bringing the total to 154, and to date, 56,608 tests have been conducted. Local fire departments are now working together to ensure they're all up to staff during the coronavirus pandemic, similar to a mutual aid agreement, which allows departments to share equipment during emergency situations. Fire departments here in Western Mass are now agreeing to share personnel. This is in the event that a positive coronavirus case or quarantine impacts the staffing of one town's department. And the New England Patriots jet landing at Logan Airport today, carrying more than a million N95 masks from China. Governor Charlie Baker saying the personal protection equipment will go to our state's health care workers on the front lines of the coronavirus pandemic. The governor extending an emotional thank you to the Kraft family, owners of the Patriots, for their generosity in this time of great need. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown with a check of your forecast and we are dealing with a coastal storm into Friday so tonight we're going to be dealing with more showers. They'll be around all night on and off. Breezy and cool winds are still kind of gusting up to about 25 miles an hour at times and temperatures will drop to around 40 degrees. Everyone's staying above freezing. Tomorrow looking like kind of a dreary and damp day. We will have occasional showers around on and off in the morning out through the evening. Still very blustery with wind coming down out of the north. Gust could still top 30 miles an hour. And highs will be only getting into the middle and upper 40s, kind of a raw afternoon on tap. So this coastal storm will start pushing farther east and away from the coast by this weekend. High pressure will start digging in Saturday, but we're still fairly cloudy and still a little brisk. A cold front will come in during the overnight hours Sunday into Monday with maybe a stray shower. But other than that, it looks like a nice dry stretch on the way. And we'll see a little bit more sunshine, especially as we head into early next week with temperatures climbing into the 60s. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.